What a beautiful day today it is out here in uh, Corpus Christi, not too far from Packery Channel, just northeast of Packery Channel. Today we're going to try to uh, catch some pompano. I'm using some pompano rigs, as you can see, with two hooks set up. We're going to be using Easy Shrimp, Fish Bites, Pink and White, and Fish and Strips, Sand Flea. So one pole is going to have sand flea, the other one's going to have the shrimp on. It's time for another crazy beach bum fishing trip. But today, guys, we got our secret weapon today. <laughs> and here it is right here, fish fry. That means I'm guaranteed to catch something today, right? So I'll be using two Pen Battle 3s, a 4,000 and a 5,000, and some pompano rigs, baited with fish bites and little piece of shrimp. Alright, we're just gonna probably cast out right past, right before the first sandbar, not too far out. So we don't have to really go out in the water that far. Right there where it's breaking at. The sand flea, fish bites, and a little piece of shrimp on each hook. So we'll see what we can get here. Nothing. I think I got something on this pole. The damn jellyfish hurts, guys. Yeah, I think I got my first fish. I don't know. It's kind of hard to tell. Big old jellyfish rubbed up against my leg. Probably a damn little hard head or something. I don't know what it is. Yep. Yep. Oh, it's a little freaking uh, nice size whiting. Is it? Yeah, it's a nice size whiting. I should make him for dinner. I'm gonna go ahead and keep him. Damn, that jellyfish hurts. Right there is a the jellyfish that got me on the leg. Kind of stings. It's not too bad, but he got me wrapped around my leg. Yep. Oh, I don't know. That damn weight gets buried in the sand, so it's hard to tell. But there was a bite. Nope, think he got off. No, I might still have him. Yeah, I got him. Might be a good size whiting. Could be a pump. Oh, he got off right there, man. Son of a beanbag. Damn it. There's some big, huge jellyfish. One rubbed up against my leg and I'm telling you it's stinging like crazy. There's one right there. That's the kind of one that hit my leg. And then there's another one over there. Another one right here. Another one right by my pole. And damn things hurt. I was out there in the water and I felt something rub against my leg and I was like, oh shit, what the hell's that? And looked down, and it was one of these jellyfish. So I've been getting hits left and right. I just can't get them in, man. Had a couple of big ones. One bend this pole big time. And then one got off right up here at shore. It could have been a pompano. It was dark colored fish. Looked like it had some stripes on the top. There's a lot of bait fish here. Hey, we got a fish. Oh, shit. It's a lot of slack. Yep, we got a fish. Hopefully it's another whiting. If this is a whiting, this is a good size one. 
Oh, look at that. Two ladyfish. Perfect bait. One strangled. Perfect bait. Let's see what we got. Hopefully it's not a damn big ladyfish, but I think it is because it came to the top of the water. What's it gonna be? It's swimming towards me right now. That's a baby shark. Don't want him to get me. There you go, my friend. Nice shark. See that? Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. There he goes. Fish on, guys. I don't know what it is. Hopefully it's not a shark. Come on, be something decent. I guess sharks are right. Here he comes. Uh, I don't know what it is. Might be another... Nope, another damn shark. When your life's been put on hold for far too long When the sorrow and despair is growing strong There is always something good to be obtained From breaking loose and leave the things that kept you chained Hopefully it's not another shark. Yeah, I still got him. I just hope it's not another shark. This is a bigger one, whatever it is. He's going down the beach. Just don't be another shark, damn it. That's a monster freaking trout, man. So he's 24 inches. Catching anything? You ain't gonna catch no fish sleeping. <laughs> Any luck? I'm going fish pass. Ain't no luck here. Close to where those barriers are up there, I caught a 24 inch trout. Oh, wow. And then a couple of shark. You get anything? Uh, mm -hmm. Some sand trap today, sir, and some shark. Oh, really? Yeah, I caught a couple of shark and then a, a trout. About 24 inches, just a little ways down that way. Nice being out here though. Yeah, it's nice. Nah, nah. Appreciate you guys watching this video. I got to go to work tonight, so I only come out here for a couple hours. That was a good sized trout. I wish I would catch more of those. And if I would have caught two or three trout, I would have let two of them go and kept one. I just needed something for dinner tonight. I'm gonna start carrying a bag of fish fry with me, guys, because that seems to be the, uh, the key right there to uh, catching fish. Carry you a bag of fish fry. <laughs>
I don't know. Usually I smoke them on a smoker, but this time I'm gonna fry that trout up. I may, I may change my mind and put them on a smoker, I don't know. Appreciate you guys watching this video, man. Hit that subscribe, hit the like button, and peace. We'll see you next time we're at the beach or at the jetties or in the bays, I don't know. Peace.